In this video, we will discuss peripherally inserted central catheters in pediatric patients. The PIC is a small gauge elastic or polyurethane catheter that is advanced through peripheral veins, usually of the upper arm or forearm, with a tip positioned centrally. Vein placement depends on location. In the arm, you would consider the basilic, brachials, or cephalic veins, and in the leg, the common femoral vein. Indications for a PIC include long-term IV antibiotics, TPN, frequent blood draws, delivery of caustic medications, or administration of vasoactives. Relative contraindications include a known occlusion or thrombosis, positive blood cultures, skin infection at the insertion site, future dialysis, or an AV fistula or AV graft in the same extremity as the planned PIC. The number of available channels depends on a variety of factors. For instance, some medications cannot be mixed due to crystallization and clotting, and other times, multiple medications need to be running continuously. Another factor to keep in mind is that the number of lumens correlates with an increased risk of infection and thrombosis. The unit of measurement describing a catheter's external diameter is French. One rule of thumb is that 3 French equals 1 millimeter. The choice of pick is based on vessel diameter, which in turn is correlated with weight, age, and site selection. The larger the pick size, the higher the risk of thrombosis. We suggest that in pediatric patients greater than 5 kilograms, the arm pick should be considered. If a patient is less than 5 kilograms and an arm pick is still required, consider 1.9 French single or 2.6 French dual. Otherwise, consider a leg pick. A variety of catheter limitations exist. For instance, there is an inability to draw blood from a 1.9 French single. And in a 2.6 French dual, the smaller lumen is difficult to keep open after a few weeks. Rare complications include thrombosis, infection, and catheter blockage or displacement. And even rarer complications include catheter breakage and injury to the vessel itself or the surrounding neurovasculature. Shown here are the variety of items used for pick placement. The first step is to ultrasound the upper arm to evaluate the vein course and size. Inject lidocaine. Insert the needle, then insert the guide wire under fluoroscopic guidance, Remove the micropuncture needle, followed by a small incision, and then place the peel away sheath. The tip of the pick should be located at the superior cavoatrial junction, which is one and a half to two vertebral bodies below the carina. Insert the pick over the wire through the peel away sheath, and then remove the peel away sheath and wire. Flush the pick with heparin. Suture or stat lock the pick in place. And lastly, apply an overlying dressing. For a tunneled pick in the leg, a long needle is inserted from the lower thigh region to create a subcutaneous tunnel prior to common femoral vein entry in the groin area, keeping the catheter entry site far below the diaper line. The final pick tip is located near the inferior cable atrial junction.